checking the web everywhere on the web for the best indie google review i had to go to different web platforms to get a summary of what they say their pros their cons like we've seen the first pros on the screen that said indiegogo is a crowdfunding for both tech and creative projects and you can choose all or nothing funding or keep it all funding you can run a patron style ongoing crowdfunding campaign after your initial campaign succeed and there is no platform fee for charitable campaign campaigns but you can have a good customer support system now looking at the cons so what does indigo overview says it says if there is one characteristic that defines indigo is its flexibility since 2008 when it was launched in sudan film festival as a crowdfunding platform for independent film the name has been launched and it has been used over time but just like some goods get rid of as time goes i don't know what i'm going to say about indiegogo quality dropping and user complaining but this video is going to tell you why you shouldn't continue with them as a crowdfunding platform due to a lot of users complaints and due to poor credibility score indiegogo is a crowdfunding platform in which you can raise funds fund as an individual or to boost your project or to launch a tech or anything innovative and under the tech category you could see audio camera gear energy green tech fashion wearables food transport and under creative works you could actually see art comic dance theater film music photography tabletop games video games and the long list continues and then there are different 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 categories you could actually put your eyes into and reconsider as long as um, you need a funding such as community projects which include animal rights, cultural education, environment, even human rights including local businesses, wellness and the long list continues. So Indiegogo was launched on a very good note with you doing a lot of things, a lot of flexibility but along the line a lot of things went so wrong and what are those things? Such of those things include the platform not being able to meet user standard and then the platform not being able to maintain its credibility score because it didn't checkmate some things that went wrong funding duration actually went or actually spans for 60 days now a review a reviewer said that by design it is a loosely regulated cloud funding arena intended to give the widest possible range of creative and charitable courses causes the ability to attract funding from a community of backers. However, this entails a great deal of covered empty for backers. Indigo currently earns a grim at 1.1 out of 10 on an average of 5 star rating of 10 star rating. So imagine um, if it's a 5 star rating that means they are practically on half star not even a 1. This is a bad one to say. Alright, Son said Indiegogo does crowdfunding, yes, but it appears that they do not do any vetting on the campaign owners. I've not, I've now been waiting almost a year for delivery for an item, despite South Africa having been open for international delivery since before July last year. The campaign owner, China, Hong Kong based appears as it appears, has been sending general updates that mean nothing. I'm sure Indiegogo must know about this, yet there's no sign of intervention their accountability seems questionable another user has said Indigo is a hotbed for scammers i have backed around 25 projects and over 50 percent of them turned out to be scams i've been stupid enough to fall for all the lies and deceit fit to me on the indigo platform igg rules says no scam and so on but they apparently do nothing to vet the campaign nor do they have any process to control or manage the campaign. So in summary, users, individuals have been acting so tricky, scamming others, and this platform has done nothing about it. So for you watching this video or reading this review, considering to work with them, someone already said it is a horrible experience similar to as what had already been said by other users. Uploading photos and videos took forever, but the worst was when the link was not working. So people who intended to support the project couldn't find it on their site. So he was complaining several times with responses after days. That means their customer support system as well is bad. That means their customer support system isn't working. 
and they don't look into complaints and their technical analysis is poor their technical department isn't working as well and that means that users will continue complaining someone is already saying for two years i've paid over 230 dollars however i didn't receive any perks i've contacted campaigners several times but nobody responded now do you want to actually put your money into something like this i will say no don't forget to kindly like and subscribe turn on the notification because i'll continue doing review videos to keep you all updated thanks